Tutorial number two, Manage Rotations. Welcome to the Skyview Network's Fast Web Automation Tutorial for Section 2, Manage Rotations. In this tutorial, we will explore how to add and upload spots, create rotations, and set the rotations flight. First, click the Manage Rotations button to navigate to the Rotation Spots Management window. Rotations in the FAST system are used to flight and rotate spots for a client. Let's walk through using the Auto Create by Name function. This feature creates a new rotation and a new spot within the system using a name specified by the user. After clicking the Auto Create by Name button, a new window will appear. Fill in the rotation and spot name, then select the spot length in seconds from the drop-down list. Click OK to continue. You will notice a new rotation has been created in the Rotations list, as well as a new spot added to the Spots list. Spots highlighted in pink still need to have their audio uploaded to the receiver. To upload audio for the spot, select the spot in Spots list and click the Edit Spot button. This next screen allows you to edit the spot information, including adding optional information, such as cart number, or ISCII code. At the bottom of the window, check the Upload Audio box, then click Save. Clicking the Browse button will allow you to search through your computer to select the file that corresponds with the spot. It is very important that you select an MP3 or WAV file that is at least 128 kilobytes per second and at most 320 kilobytes per second and must use a sample rate of 44.1 kilohertz. If the file is not at these settings, it will not play properly from the satellite receiver. After the correct file is selected, click the OK button to begin the upload. Let's look at some of the other buttons on the Manage Rotations menu. The Auto Create by File is used for the automatic upload and creation of rotations by spot. A spot or group of spots is selected by browsing your computer and the FAST system will create a list of spots and rotations with the same title as the uploaded files. The Add Spot button allows the creation of a new commercial spot without creating a new rotation. Once clicked, first select the advertiser in the drop-down, then if you choose, you can use a cart number or ISCII code to track your spots. Add Category will create a new advertiser category. The system uses categories to help prevent like advertisers playing in the same break. For example, Bob's Auto Repair and Jiffy Lube both fall under the category Automotive Shop and therefore cannot be scheduled within the same break. You may create a non-exclusive category by simply checking the corresponding box in the Category Management window. The Rotation Edit screen allows for spots to be made into flights and flights to be set into the rotation. Let's click on a rotation and then click Edit Rotation to bring up its details. The main navigation starts from top to bottom and includes flight dates, the rotation length, the rotation category, flight navigation, and spot addition. The flight dates at the top allow for the navigation of the already created flights with back and forward buttons if more than one flight is available. To select a flight, simply click on the date range on the top of the page. The rotation's length, name, and category come next, and except for name are simple drop-downs that let the user set up the rotation specifics. The Rotation Length drop-down will be disabled if the flight is scheduled in a break. The next section is the Flight Start Date, the Flight Navigation Buttons, and finally, the Flight End Date. Both flight dates are clickable boxes that let you choose the date from a calendar. There are four flight buttons. Add Flight. This creates a new flight. Copy Flight. This button copies the currently selected flight with dates equal to the equivalent time of the flight, one day after the flight ends. You cannot copy flights with TFN selected. Equalize. This will make all the spots in the selected flight have an equal rotation percentage. Remove flight. 
This button will simply delete the selected flight. The Add Spot button opens up the Spot Selection window. This window is used to add a previously created spot and the percentage the spot is to be played in the rotation. The spot name is selected in the drop-down and then the percentage is entered in the percentage text box. Once the details are put in, click Add to close the window. You will now see your spot listed here. After you have created your rotations and uploaded spots, you are ready to fill in your broadcast log with your advertisers. Please watch the tutorial calendar view to review creating a game log or continue on the tutorial copy, spot check, and reports.